Greetings Nebbits and Newbert is here once again and today I'm going to show you what I promised you in the last video actually and that is to show you how the crafting disciplines works. And first I'll have to pick which one which which ones in fact since you can pick two at once. There are a total of eight um, crafting disciplines which you can pick two by again as I just mentioned. Um there are the following Armorsmith. Artificer, chef, huntsman, jeweler, leather worker, tailor, and weaponsmith. Just to mention which ones do what quickly. The armorsmith makes heavy armor. Uh, Artificer makes uh, different magical weapons that can be staves, scepters, and so on. Chefs makes food to regain health. Huntsman makes uh, different uh, long range weapons that's rifles, bows, guns, and so on. Jeweler um, makes earrings, necklaces, and rings, which can give you more stats. Leather workers are making medium armor. Tailors are making light armor, and then the weaponsmiths makes guess what? Weapons, and that is swords, daggers, and so on and so forth. And as you already might have noticed uh, on the footage, did I end out picking tailoring and artificer? Um, I did that because, first of all, the mesmer does only wear light armor. That means that an armorsmith or a leather worker wouldn't fit my profession under any circumstances. And uh, artificer I picked because, well, my character will be using uh, staves and scepters most likely. It can use guns as well. Uh, and swords for that matter also, but I went with what I felt was the right thing. Um, it was even that or as chef in, as the second one, but we'll see what happens. Right, okay here I've stolen a small part of footage from another video pretty much. This is to show you the different crafting materials uh, you can gather from the wilderness. So let's try to maximize the minimum on the right hand corner. Okay, I have three different kinds of materials that you can gather yourself. There are other materials you can use as well for um, crafting, but there are three different kinds you can gather yourself. There are there is uh, stuff you can harvest with an axe that means trees. There are stuff you can harvest with a pickaxe that means uh, ores and such. Then there's in the end there's different kinds of herbs that you can gather as well. These different materials do then fit into different uh, crafting disciplines. As an example, do the herbs normally fit into the chef discipline, but some of the herbs does fit with other disciplines as well. And that's the, that's the case with other the other two materials as well. Like the lumber can go for both huntsmen and artisivers and so on and so forth. And as far as all other ways of um, getting materials, that can be by looting enemies you've killed. As an example, the cloth, which you are using for tailoring, as an example. Um, and then there's salvaging, which is somewhat like a disenchanting in WoW, where you um, more or less destroy the item you have, could both be armor or other stuff, um, and then you get some materials out of it they can use for some kind of crafting discipline. And then you can buy something from vendors as well. Right, and now on to the crafting itself. Um, you pretty much have a menu for y both of the crafting disciplines. Then you can see what different stuff you can craft and how many you can create of it um, compared to how many materials you have. Currently I'm making different wood planks as you can see and well I'm out of those now so I'm able to make more stuff. Um, I'm loading my assessor thing. Uh, you can see that up in the top of this window and I'm still leveling it. To um, generate new stuff you can create, you have to discover it. And to discover it, you basically um, combine different materials that you have. You have to be a specific level to do that. And by getting a specific level, you do that by making more stuff. So to find or discover new stuff you can make, you have to make more stuff of what you already can make. As well as that type of thing. Oh, Christ, I'll look at the word, right? <laughs> uh, you, of course, have the tailoring to work with as well. Um, thanks, something I forgot to add was that you need to be at the specific station for the crafting discipline. But that I mean you have to be at the specific, you have to be at a station that fits the current crafting discipline you're going to work with. That means you can make tailoring supplies at a armorsmith and so on. I'm currently working with some kind of cloth which I have made into bowls. Um, I'm 
by using that I can make different bags and such. Once again I have to discover more stuff before I can make something good. <laughs> Anyways, that was it for this time guys, I know it was a very short video, it took a long time to make though. Um, so any comments, uh, any likes, anything really, any rating of the video would be very appreciated. Um, thank you for watching, as always, and else I hope I'll see you guys next time, and Anubit is out.